I've reconsidered my opinion of you, inmate. The look on your face seems to be that of a man who has accomplished a great deed. To think you would use the trap set against you to entrap them. I've never seen a dramatic resurgence such as that. Truly marvelous. Those are the only words I can think of to describe you. We should be thanking you for entertaining us thus. You've even overcome a mysterious misfortune. There should be no one left to hinder your rehabilitation. Your rehabilitation will be completed shortly. That is, if everything goes well, without any problems. <laughs> this dream or could it be that it's not a dream at all my memories aren't any closer to coming back to me but might there be something I'm supposed to remember oh. if if I'm really not human and if the truth of that comes to pass down in the depths of mementos I could it be that I'll <sighs> hmm Despite the um, victory over Shido and pretty much narrowly escaping his palace, um, we uh, Mona's still having those dreams. Yeah, I wonder why. Could it be that he actually isn't a cat? Well, he's by virtue of actually be, being able to turn into a cartoon anyway. Anyway, that being said, today we're going to hang out with Yusuke and complete his uh, social link as well. Um, yeah, I am going to... Uh, because today is for uh, completing social links. Or oh, confidence, should I say. So I'm going to complete both Yusuke's and um, Hifumi's um, so, um, confidence. So yeah. I still have much to learn, but I finally painted something that I can be satisfied with. Yes, this is the true heart of humanity. The title is Desire and Hope. What do you think? Well, I added aspects that were previously lacking. This light is all of you. The title lists hope, but in my mind, it's a much more concrete thing. I can't believe I didn't realize that until now. Mmm. You. It's a good painting. Huh? It's not trying to be eccentric for the sake of being eccentric like the last time. To think the same painting can change this much. So this is the answer you've come up with. It is. Desire and hope, I see. Beauty and ugliness. Humans are creatures that possess both. It seems you understand that. What are you playing at? I apologize, although my intent was to encourage you. It was rather crude. Still, I believe that this ploy needed to be done in order to ignite your competitive spirit. But why would you do that? What's your objective? I wanted to do something for you as another person who is free from Matarame's chains. That's all. Matarame held a grudge against me for supposedly stealing his customers from him. To start, I couldn't get anyone to rent me space for exhibits. He caused me no end of hardship. So that's why. Yes, the heart of man is painted with desire, even if it's coated entirely in black at times. 
However, it seems you have the strength to not look away from it, and chose to stand up against it. If only he had your strength. Matarame and I go back a long way. First as classmates, then as teachers at the same art school. He used to have a noble spirit. Said he wanted to aim for the top of the art world one day. Huh. But in the end, even the art world has its share of politics. Those who are cunning win. Our hearts were stained black in that manner. But the human heart is a strange thing. It can't completely separate black from white. I was shocked when I heard that he took you in. He never liked children, you see. Oh? This happened just before we cut all ties from each other. He was panicking that nearby clinics were closed and that his kid had a fever. Sensei. Yeah. I don't want any more losers like me or misguided winners like him being born from this world. That's why I started this foundation. So how about it? Would you like our support? <laughs> Without the overbearing marketing production, of course. It's a truly kind offer. Thank you for your generosity. However, I must respectfully decline. Huh. What makes you say that? I am not Madarame. I won't be stained by desire. After all, I can see hope. If I am lost, they will extend their hands. If I am wrong, they will chastise me. As long as I have my rays of hope to guide me, I will be fine. Ha! Madarame really did have a good eye. <laughs> what a strange man. Sacrificing one's own money for the sake of others. That's not something anyone can do. Perhaps it's a tad wasteful of me to decline. Still, I believe it's for the best. I feel contradictory, but that's the human heart, correct? <sighs> Interesting. That's exactly what I should be painting. It must have been troublesome dealing with me. But for some reason, I knew that you wouldn't abandon me until everything was said and done. Thank you, my friend. blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the Emperor, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. Persona within me has awakened to a new power. All right. Now that I'm out of my slump, I need to make up for the time I wasn't able to paint. I reiterate my promise to you. I'll extend my assistance to you, should you ever stumble. Now then, shall we go? In order for me to learn more about the heart, we need to work hard on our thief business. Oh, Goemon has now become Kamu Sosano, and um, has also learned a new skill. Um, let's see. So I'm going to get rid of Counter Strike to get Ibid Fire. Yes, it may not be that great, but never mind. I I will bring that in. Uh, so now yeah, with. Uh, uh, I uh, see that one complete. Let's actually. Um, what about. Um, I thought I completed the uh, Soji Rose one. I suppose I could do that, but Next not time. today, I don't think. Today we're gonna go see, as I say, Hifumi. Because, um, yeah. But. I guess it will take a while before um, 
people see the truth, even though we kind of expose Shido. Well, so be it. Uh, I'm gonna go to Mr. Tanaka's website and see what's available. Yes, let's see. More gun okay, more homunculi I do want. Certainly. Um, so yeah. I don't want to did take a thing in Shido's palace. What about a Ouija board, but never mind. Anyway, onward to the, uh, uh, church, I say. I quit the Ladies Professional Shogi Players Association. I need to start over as an amateur. That's my intention. There were a lot of people who covered for me by saying that I was just being used by adults. But I'm the one who was most at fault. I was overconfident. If only I had taken a look at myself and properly assessed my shogi skills, I believed that with my skills, I could overcome being treated like an idol. There's nothing I can say about my mother. You didn't abandon me. Even after you learned about the fixed matches, now I know how encouraging it feels to have someone believe in you. At first, this was just a deal. You help me develop new moves and I give you shogi lessons. But before I knew it, you became... someone I couldn't do without. I'm not gonna pay attention to all the criticism anymore. This time, I'll earn everyone's praise with my own skills. The reason I'm able to think this way is because you stuck by my side. I'm really grateful. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast owned to the ultimate secret of the star, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. Well then, on to our final lesson. I truly hope that you... No. That the Phantom Thieves find my lessons useful. Yes. I spoke to you about my mother, and then my mother changed. I knew that couldn't be a coincidence. If there's anything I can do to help, please know that you can rely on me. I will support you in whatever you want to accomplish. Now let's play a match. I have a lot of new moves I'd like to test out. I hope you're okay to stay here a while longer. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. <laughs>